Northside ISD taxpayers will make a nearly billion dollar decision when they head to the polls on Saturday. The school district is asking voters to approve a bond proposal that will mostly go to renovating existing schools in that district. The bond money will be borrowed and then paid back over time. RJ Marquez spoke to Superintendent Dr. Brian Woods to break down more of what voters need to know. Northside ISD has seen major growth and expansion in recent years, but Dr. Brian Woods says this latest bond proposal is about making sure older schools in the district have a future. The proposal itself is 95% about investing in schools that are 40 years old or older. The total amount of the proposed bond is $992 million, but before voters make this decision, Woods wanted to clear up some misconceptions. There will be no associated tax rate increase with this proposal. However, because of a change the legislature made in 2019, they inserted language for school districts. The language has led to confusion, but Wood says the district has not had a tax rate increase in the past 12 years. No school district in the state controls appraised values. What we do control is that tax rate, and we can promise it will not increase as a result of this proposal. The proposed bond would pay for upgrading more than 20 existing Northside ISD schools, and that includes John Jay High School, which is looking to upgrade its Science and Engineering Academy, pay for parking, and also upgrade Grade its ROTC facilities. Like John Jay, more than half of the district schools are decades old. $645.5 million would be invested in these schools. HVAC units and making them more efficient, replacing roofs so that they don't leak, replacing flooring that's, that's become problematic, or paving and drainage. The proposal also includes tech, security, transportation, and library upgrades, plus a new elementary school but mostly is about giving more opportunities for students in older schools to succeed. Zip code shouldn't determine the quality of the facility or for that matter, a teacher that a child has. And we're trying to make good on that promise. RJ Marquez, KSAT 12 News.